Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I decided to step a little bit outside of my comfort zone and do a really fun glittery, not glitter not outside my comfort zone, but really fun rainbow glittery look. It really wasn't too hard to create. It only took three palettes of mine. However, one of the palettes that I used was a custom color pop palette, but these three are the shades that I used. I'll give you the names of those in the video as well. So if you like this look that I've created, please go ahead and keep watching and figure out how I did it. So I already have my eyes primed and ready to go. So we're just gonna go ahead and dive right in. So for the red, I'm gonna be using the Morphe 3502 palette and I'm gonna be using this red shade right here. I'm gonna keep this kind of right in the corner. We don't wanna bring it out too far. I think that's a nice start. What do you think? I think I'm asking you because you're obviously going to respond. And then for the orange, I'm also using the 3502 and I'm going to use this orange one right here. I wish I knew these shade names, but alas, I don't because Morphe does not put them on the palette. And I am using the same crease brush. Um, I don't have a color switch or anything, so I kind of just rub it on whatever I can find. A makeup wipe, my pants, my hands, whatever. I'll clean them later. It's fine. I'm just going to blend these two together. Okay, and then yellow, I'm going into my Lorella Cosmetics on the end palette right here. And I'm going to use the shade Beehive. If you haven't watched my review video on this palette, please go watch it. I will have a card right above up here. With the yellow, I'm having to actually like pack it on before squishing and blending the plastic. And then for our green, blue, and purple, we're going to be using my custom color pop palette right here. I'm going to be using these three shades. So the green is called Conjure Up, and this is it. This blue is called Backstage. I'm going back into Beehive from the Relic Cosmetics palette. I'm just going to deepen up my yellow. And then I'm going to take my heart shape tape and I'm going to cut out my crease. This is just a flat, rounded Morphe brush. So now I'm going to take Going Study from my Colourpop palette and I'm just going to throw that on the outer corner of where I cut my crease. And then going in on a really, really small, thin, flat Morphe brush, I'm going to go into also going steady, and I'm just going to make it really defined right here on the crease.
And now I'm going to go into my favorite shade lately, which is White Show by ColourPop. It is a pressed glitter and it is beautiful. I'm going to take my Morphe M167 brush right here and I'm going to use that to pack on the glitter. All of this glitter is going to go in the rest of the cut crease area. And then to get my glitter in all of the really fine small lines in my crease, I'm going to use my e.l.f. concealer brush right here. It's a very small dark guy. With this glitter, I don't use any kind of glitter glue or eyelash glue or anything like that. I really just go ahead and I, I really just pack it right on. Okay, so this is the finished eye so far. I'm gonna go ahead and do this eye real quickly and I'll be back. Now all I have to do is my face makeup and my little lash line, and that should be it.
It's not my first time driving, but whatever, we're going with it. to finish up our eyes. I'm gonna take this small smudgy brush. I don't know who it's by or where it's from. I've had it for a long while, but this is what I'm gonna take to do my lower lash line. So here is the final look. I did add lashes and I also added lipstick. One of my new favorites, which is the Maybelline Vivid Hot Lacquer in the shade 
unreal. I do really like the way it turned out. If you also like the way it turned out, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to me as well. I do try to put out a new video at least once or twice a week. And that's it for today's video. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of the week.